Start your adventure at the Tulsa Boat Sport and Travel Show. Shop a huge selection of boats and RVs for every lifestyle and budget at the absolute best prices of the year. Meet the world champion wakeboard pros from MTV's Wake Brothers and the guys from Animal Planet's Hillbilly Hand Fishing. Experience family fun at its best January 28th through February 3rd at Expo Center. Presented by the Green Country Chevy Dealers. You deserve it. The time is now. It's time to buy that boat. TulsaBoatShow.com Welcome to the neighborhood. We've invited Agent Earl to show off a bunch of tips to green up your home. Let's go. First stop, TV Central. If you plug in your TV Blu-ray player and the rest of your home theater setup into a smart strip like this, power only goes to the components after the TV is turned on. Turn off the TV and every bit of power is cut off from your gear. Without a smart power strip like this, electronics can draw a phantom load, sometimes referred to as vampire power. Vampires are bad. Sorry, Team Edward. Next stop, the home office. And again, it's a smart strip to the rescue. Getting a new laptop? Make sure it's Energy Star certified and that you have the Energy Saver feature enabled once you get it home. This makes sure when you stop working, it dips to low power mode. And here's an easy tip. Only use Energy Star qualified compact fluorescent bulbs in your house. With each bulb, you can save about 30 bucks over its lifetime and it'll pay for itself in about six months. It uses 75% less energy and lasts about 10 times longer than an incandescent bulb. 
just think, if every U.S. household replaced just six incandescent light bulbs with compact fluorescence, it would be the equivalent to taking just over four million cars off the road for good. And admit it, you've got old electronics sitting in your house. They've got lead, mercury, and other not-so-cool stuff inside them. Just take them to Best Buy for recycling. While you're at it, remember that all the boxes your fun new electronics come in are totally recyclable. And this stuff, called polystyrene, is recyclable too. Earth911.com is a great place to locate recyclers of polystyrene where you live. You know all those remotes, digital cameras, and other things that eat batteries in your life? A little rechargeable battery station like this pays for itself in no time. Okay, let's hit the road. One last check of the programmable thermostat that makes sure we're only heating and cooling when the house is occupied and we're good to go. For lots more tips to live and play green, check out energystar.gov or bestbuy.com slash green. Greening your home is easy. Make changes now and before you know it, you'll save money and go easier on the planet. Hi there, I'm Howie Long, and this is Rick Spina from Chevrolet. Rick knows a whole bunch about trucks, and in particular, Chevy trucks, which is a good thing, because today we're going to put the Chevy Silverado HD up against the competition head-to-head. -head. What do you got, Rick? Hi, how are you doing? Howie? George, fill Howie in on what's going on here. All right. These are all one-ton heavy-duty trucks, and the trailer behind us is loaded to 16 thousand pounds. That's over eight tons. And that's a lot of weight. The, the reality is, is both the Silverado HD and the Ford Super Duty will handle even more. But we limited the weight to 16 and a half thousand pounds because the Ram, that is all it can handle. You know, Silverado HD is rated at over 10 tons worth of towing. The max towing capacity is 21,700 pounds. I told you it's going to be fun. All right. <laughs> OK, so now we're headed up the hill. We're going to make a run at passing the semi going up a 7% incline, towing 16,000 plus pounds behind us. Get it done. Marker. Okay, coming up with a passing now. marker. Here we go. Boy, I'll tell you what, the acceleration is great. We're Maybe. blowing by the semi. OK, here we come. We've got that big snow plow with the blinking lights up ahead. Are we going to make it? That was a piece of cake. 